USW. Um, that stands for Designer Shoe Warehouse. I think they're pretty much everywhere, but if you don't have one in your neck of the woods, you can just go to, to them online and um, go to dsw.com. The pair of boots that I'm going to talk about today is Steve Madden. I know Steve Madden is carried in a lot of different stores, so it doesn't have to be DSW where you get these. You can get them from his site or probably a store near you. Um, and of course he has so much to choose from and uh, this one I can't wait to share with you this oh ho, ho, ho. wait till you see it girl I fell in love with these I have to have them they're kind of a cross between Edward Scissorhands and maybe witchy poo I'm not sure, but I saw these, of course, buckles this year for 2020 fall are huge. You're going to see buckles on just about every boot. You're going to see that last boot that I reviewed, I showed you, which was the coach boot, um, the VIO, V-I-O, I got from DSW. It has a buckle on it. When you go and look, you're going to see almost everything is going to have buckles. Um, there's some who, that don't, you know, there's going to be the, the ones that are just more slick and and basic, but this kind of buckle trend right now, I'm loving. Um, this is an all leather boot. This, of course, in the black color, and it has the side zipper, so it's easy on, easy off. It has a nice cush lining inside, and there's the Steve Madden inside um, here. With boots, I like to get a half size bigger. And that's only because I like to wear a sock with it. Um, a, a boot like this is a little bit tighter to the ankle and it's supposed to be like that. You know, so you can wear it with skirts, you can wear it with a skinny jean, you can wear it with a lot of leggings, a lot of different types of fashion. So it fits closer to the, to the ankle. So um, as far as tightness also. So that changes the type of sock that I would wear with this one here. This uh, this boot, I would wear a sock that I picked up at DSW when I purchased this. These here, they're called the Dr. Motion. Um, it's a full length sock and sorry, I have an itch. <laughs> but this sock here, it is a, a full length sock. It's a compression sock. So it's a, a thinner sock, but it's gonna have a little bit more compression on the leg. Um, but it's since it's thin, I can get away wearing these with that type of boot and not have it like cut off my circulation because hello, I'm a curvy girl and my ankles are curvy too. This is gonna help suck them in just a little bit. Um, these socks I did get at DSW. Pardon me while I pop my eyes on, but they're $7.99 for the Dr. Motion. And you can wear these with about anything. And if your pants were to write up or your skirt or whatever, um, all they're gonna see is a nice black sock. It's gonna look like a dressy sock. So this is an option for you. The other one I picked up is a black. It's also the Dr. Motion um, with a polka dot. I just thought it was kind of fun, different. I can wear it with my other boots too. They're stretchy. Um, going to be really comfortable and cover up your leg if there's anything peeking through and it's cold out, a little wind blowing up, you know, your pant leg, something like that would be really nice. Other pair of socks I picked up from UGG. I love UGG. Um, a lot of people do. I love their boots, um, but I love their socks. Their socks are really, really warm. It's a thicker sock, so I would wear this probably with the other boot, the coach one that I was referring to because this is gonna just be nice. That boot is more roomy. I can wear a thicker sock and be, you know, totally comfortable. These socks here, again, my eyes. Roar. Ooh, these were $18. Didn't know that when I was buying them, but I say they're well worth it. So I'm sure you can get them on sale. You can get them at other places, um, but, but 
you know, they're going to last too. And they come in lots of different colors. I got this one. It's just a nice neutral. Um, but they're soft and they're fuzzy and they're warm. So, yes, got the three pair of socks, all for boots. And then the boots, these ones here, to go with the thinner sock. But I absolutely love these. Take a look, take a look. I'll show you a little bit more. Look at that heel detail. It's got a pointy toe. Isn't that cute? And then the bottom, it's it's got a little bit of a ridge on it. I don't know if you can see that there and on the heel, but not a whole lot. So um, if you're on ice or frost or something like that, I don't think you're going to have a lot of luck as far as traction. So um, I'd be probably really careful. But they do have the things that you can put onto the bottom of your shoes. They stick on. It's kind of like a a greedy sandpaper so if you um, have boots like this you can go ahead and pop it on it just makes it a little more safer to wear it out and about um, without slipping and sliding but I love these what do you think are they a little too Edward scissor hands are they just ugly do you love them I do I really do like I said they're just to, for me and for my age they're a little bit edgy and I like edgy it's edgy and curvy. Hey, they go together, right? <laughs> I'm just playing with you. <laughs> you know, my weird sense of humor that I have um, comes out every now and then. Um, I'm just playful. I'm no, no harm, no harm. Don't mean it. You know, don't take offense. <laughs> like I said, I'm just playing with you. I really do thank you guys for joining me for this boot review. Um, this boot here, see if there's a name for it. It's called the Glory. Hmm. Glory, Glory, Glory Boot. <laughs> I better go. I think I need some coffee. <laughs> or maybe the problem is I've had too much. Anyway, please like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so that you know when I have a new video come out. Um, and then, if you share the video with someone, I'd appreciate it too. But until next time, I'll see you later. Thanks. Bye-bye.